This is Mike Callahan, Dr. Filefinder, and welcome back to our special Butterstash.com 10-part series on Quicken Online. In this segment, we're going to look at the Goals tab. Now, the Goals is basically your budget. And what the Goals tab does is let you watch certain categories, set yourself some goals, and then try to see if you can stay within those goals. So here are a few things that are already in here. But if we scroll to the bottom, you can say, select a category. So say you think you've been spending too much on business. So we'll add business. And there you see, we've got an amount. We can set our amount. So say we want to say, we only want to spend $1,500 on business. So we'll say that. And now you can see it adjusts. So we spent 476, we got 1,024 remaining. We can select another category. Say we're spending too much on entertainment. So we'll add entertainment. It brings it in. We don't have a goal, so we click edit. And our goal for the month is going to be to spend $100 or less on entertainment. Here again, just as with trends, this is going to depend heavily on the categories and the payees you use in your transactions. So you can see, we've allowed $100 for entertainment, haven't spent any yet. But then, this is a handy tool because you can go in and see what your goal was, whether you exceeded your goal or whether you made your goal and did better. So this is the Goals tab. It's very helpful in setting goals for yourself and then watching to see just how well you can do. And you see here, it starts at the 1st and ends at the 30th. Keep in mind this is a multiple part series and be sure to watch all 10 parts.